Welcome back, everybody. Just about 624, and it's time for our morning talker. They are partying down in, uh, let me try this, Nolens no. today. It is Fat Tuesday. The party actually started yesterday with Lundi Gras. Thousands there for the festivities. There will, of course, be the parade today, and those beads will be tossed about. <laughs> Joining us to chat about uh, stuff this morning, <laughs> Fun 107's Michael Rock, Lauren, and Larry. Good I morning. say stuff morning. because I don't know. Have you guys ever been to Mardi Gras? No, never have. It's only Jim Stern. Jim's yeah, it. I went in 94. Did you really? Yeah. I just finished recovering last week. <laughs> <laughs> How many uh, beads did you get, Jim? Uh, I, I, I cannot uh, confirm nor deny any parts of uh, beads. I don't know what beads. Beads? What, what are you talking about, Larry? Now, Jim, do you have to flash the crowd to get beads yourself? <laughs> I just gave them traffic reports, and they, they just <laughs> hand over fist to me. You know, you mentioned 95 North. You get them all Well, the you're time. so tall, I think you'd be intimidating. People would be like, here's my beads. No, I was not as tall as the, as the uh, Louisiana State Troopers, who were yeah. very uh, imposing and scary, and wow. I, I hid wow. from them. I mean, they probably yes. have to be to keep yes. that crowd in check. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, at the very end, they so. line up the horses and just chase you down Bourbon Street. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> you don't have to go home, but you, you can't, can't stay, stay here. here. But it's very laid back while it's going on. Almost anything goes, right? <laughs> just about. Yeah. So, so that's what I heard. Yeah. I don't, yeah. can't recall. He doesn't remember. <laughs> Too funny. I feel like it's Fat Tuesday after four days of being snowed in my house. I feel like I ate oh everything. Oh, my God. Right? <laughs> right. That's just how it feels when you get snowed in. Oh, my God, you just want to eat everything. <laughs> Why is it that you want to eat the terrible things for you when it's That's every outside? Tuesday for me. <laughs> yeah. It's just called food. Tuesday. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. We have to give it all up tomorrow yep. when Lent begins. So you enjoy do? it, right? <laughs> <laughs> all right. We're still celebrating the Super Bowl champions, New England Patriots. Tommy Hilfiger. Uh, had a football theme at his show yesterday. The models strutted their stuff on the runway that resembled the football stadium, complete with jumbotron, bleachers, even a scoreboard. The designer saved the best for last, though. After they all, after the, the models finished, he took a victory lap, carried a Patriots helmet. Uh, reports were that Robert Kraft was there as well, and I, I didn't realize that he was a Patriots fan. I just assumed he was from yeah. New York and he'd be some well, sort of New York fan. Well, it makes sense because he's that all-American designer, right? Well, does he have everything on the Patriots? Just red, colors. white, and blue. Maybe that's yeah. why his clothes are red, white, and blue. Because yeah. we're the Patriots. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. It's kind of neat, though, to see like them being celebrated on other platforms as well. well right. Not well, this things. guy is the, uh, I mean, this guy is fashion, so Patriots are very fashionable. This there you go. That's true. That is true. Yeah. Too bad Brady wasn't there. I right? was just going to say that, Michael. I of was just course. Say that. Walking yeah. Rap Dur <laughs> Doreen and I are going to fight over Tom Brady. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm blushing. Oh, oh look at that, blood. Michael. We're out of time. <laughs> That's good. That's a good thing. <laughs> we'll check in with you on Thursday. Yeah. You got it. Thanks, guys. guys.